Hello there, uh, this is my first 3D video and I'm in fact making this in my office. So you can see it's a bit messy back there, so try to ignore the background. So I have been using this uh, Bluetooth earphone for quite a while now and uh, it's been great. The battery backup, sound quality obviously, it's, it's amazing. So I thought let's give it a review, why not? So this is the earphone, it's called Fluffy and uh, I bought this in China. As you can see it has a quite a graffiti kind of look outside there and uh, it comes with a gift bag. So if you want to gift it to someone, so it's quite a thought they have given it here. So and uh, if you buy this in China, there are a lot of fake product out there. So they have given this serial number here. So, and there is a website where you can put it to check whether it's genuine or not. And if it has been checked once, and if you try to check it again, then it also kind of messes that it's been checked before. So that you can know that it's not an original product. So let's dig in. It's one of the best Bluetooth earphones I have used. In fact, I have used a lot of Bluetooth earphones by now. For most of the Bluetooth earphones, the problem is the battery backup. Because if you are using a Bluetooth earphone and the battery backup is not great, then you'll end up using your wired earphones. So that's not a quite point of using Bluetooth earphone anyhow. So they have this very nice packaging here. Mm -hmm. So here it is. The another good point of this earphone is it can be folded like this. And it has this nice click here, so it folds in, in position, I guess. Let's see what else is there. Ah, wow. What a packaging. So they have this. Maybe the manual, how to use it. Uh, something in Chinese, I think. For the warranty or something. That's the manual. Oh, we'll get into this in a while. Let's see what else it is in there. Ah, uh, charging cable. Oh, they have this fabric coating outside so that it will have a longer life seems durable it has fluffy written on on its charging end and it has this rubbery thing at its end so that it will have a long life anyways let's go through the manual first uh, I've been using it for a while, so I know everything about it. Still, I want to show something about it. As you can see, it says it can be stretched to this extent, not more than 300 millimeter. And I think they are quite serious about it. Because once I try to stretch it, uh, more than this and it broke I taped it so it's working quite good now it can be squeezed in as well but try not to do it uh, to a very far extent um, so next thing is It has both English and Chinese language. 
so there is instruction with which you can change the language so let's see the airflow as you can see the it can be stretched so this is the maximum extent of stretch when it stopped when it stops pulling out you you're supposed to stop uh, because it has kind of spring in there which rolls up the wire and you're not supposed to stretch more than this it uh, it has a kind of click when it uh, when the wire inside it ends and uh, these are the patterns if you press it it pulls back the wire but uh, do not press it mm -hmm. without holding the wire because when you press it it pulls back the wire very quick as you can see so uh, it's also written in the in the manual here that do not pull it you're supposed to hold it like this and then pull it so that it will not have a thrust on the wires and it can have a longer life though it has been tested so because this wire has kind of fiber inside it so it is strong and just in case uh, you broke the wire uh, you can replace it it's very convenient there are like some screws in fact I broke my wire uh, you, you, uh, you cannot always remember to be careful uh, but still I used it for like a year and then finally I broke one of the wire and I think I didn't break it while pulling down I broke it, break it while pulling, pulling out so try not to pull it too hard and while pulling in try to hold it softly and then and pull it back something like this so that this end doesn't uh, doesn't come can, can come to this end too abrupt so anyways so these are the on off pattern and when you switch it on uh, as like similar to other um, uh, air phones it has kind of vibration out there which is quite intense uh, you cannot uh, manage it I guess and uh, it has the kind of uh, masses there it's been turned on it so uh, it tells you about the battery how much battery is remaining and uh, it gives you a message that the battery is low uh, when the battery is about 15% uh, which you can see on your phone if your phone has uh, Android 8 and above it doesn't show the Bluetooth battery uh, uh, status in Android uh, other than 8 or lower so here it is sound quality is quite nice the most amazing thing about it is the battery backup as it says it has a battery backup of more than 30 hours if you use it for continuous use and uh, it is very accurate I, I used it for continuous two days here it is uh, its working distance is more than 10 meters not more than 10 meters that's obviously it's, uh, similar to other earphones charging time 2.5 hours standby time oh i was not very accurate there standby time is 160 whopping hours that's that's very good talking time is 16 hours and uh, music time is 12 hours and uh, usb power supply 5 volt 1 ampere which you don't have to worry about because most of the usb has same kind of supply uh, other you can see the button what they are supposed to most of uh, the function are similar to other bluetooth earphones like int call reject call 
in fact uh, it had like unlike other earphones it has two buttons one for to receive and reject calls and another is for to use your uh, voice commands like Google Assistant or other uh, assistant like Cortana if you're using something else so it's quite nice there that they make two different buttons for um, two different purpose they have this volume rockers uh, so it has everybody like a lot of buttons which is very convenient to use and just in case uh, you do broke the wire which is not very likely still it happens sometimes when you're not being very careful uh, i'll have make uh, another video about how to replace the wire and it's very easy and uh, there are not much wires soldered together inside so it's uh, you can do it uh, with if you have a couple of screwdriver and a soldering iron so that's it. Uh, try try the earphone. It's quite nice. Uh, like if you like the video, subscribe if you loved it. Uh, I'll see you again with another video.